Peace and blessings, family. Sister Ajalee. Mm. I don't enjoy doing these shares when I have to make an announcement because I just want to sit in my sorrow over the loss of another young person, but especially in this era where I am astounded at how easily fooled the overwhelming majority of us have been, even if you were intelligent enough not to get that jab, and neither did any of these sea lions who died within a year of Fukushima fallout. And the snow crabs are missing, the dungeon is crabs, the pile of whales are dropping dead. I mean, so many creatures. And I went over, when it comes to athletics, I've been going over our youthful dead on the battlefield. Yes, before anything that they orchestrated. And so these dudes ain't getting no daggone jab. So I want to know. How the hell we're not doing any research on what I've been sharing? That's why they took down my large channel because I had it all documented there for you with the facts. I don't get up here and just spout my opinion. I bring the data. But these dudes are masters at hiding their evil doing. Where I'm, I'm still not over the 80,000 Boy Scouts who won in a class action lawsuit proving that they had been raped systematically in the Boy Scouts and systematically this story was removed from all the headlines whatsoever so that people, I even saw a show where uh, the, one of the main persons in this reality show was upping the Boy Scouts. And so I guess, you know, folks will be like, oh, yeah, let me bring little Joey over to the Boy Scouts. And they don't realize how many of theirs are pedophiles and will go specifically to an organization like that where they're going to be out in the woods Mommy and daddy ain't going to be nowhere around and they're going to be doing whatever the hell they want with little Joey. But that's a story they drop because they do not want the world to lose faith in them. Well, I'm just telling you, when you kill oceans, you're supposed to lose. You're supposed to lose because ain't no damn explanation anybody is offering for all of these dead creatures. Right? It's just, uh, duh. I, 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 and you know, I'm getting kind of sarcastically mean right here. And I don't want to because I take pains to see things through your eyes because I've been living in the same mind frame that most of us are within where we're just not going to believe black us unless we're white approved. I will never be white approved, okay? I take that as a compliment. But at the same time, I remember when my king and I were just talking, her sister came to him and she was saying how her, she, her face is all bloated, her eyes are sunken, and we were going over, oh, you know, it's the diet and she got to do this and that. And then I recalled with him that when I first met him and he said, oh, you know, your skin, because I used to have adult acne and I only met him when I was like 36 and I had adult acne and it, I thought I'd live with that for the rest of my life. And he said, you know, you would die. You could get rid of all of that. I thought the man was crazy. I ain't pay attention to him, right? Until, you know, got to the point where he just kept giving me information because I do love the truth that much. I did further research and I said, well, this man is brilliant, but turns out he ain't crazy. He's telling me the cold hard facts. And then I started making pains to change everything. But it wasn't easy. It wasn't just a walk down the road. So I hold on to that because we're at different levels of wake up. But I'm trying to reach us before we're at one level of dead. Even their freaking bald eagles they're killing. I mean, the same organic 
functions are prevalent across species. Intelligence does not make you immune from radiation, especially if you're going to insist on being ignorant about it. So this beautiful, handsome child. Woo, I'm not going to cry, but I don't know if I could stand by that. The reason why it hurts me to highlight him is because, number one, I know this is going to be like the lowest view share ever, right? (laughs) Because I ain't white approved. And this isn't a white approved topic. Everybody wants to talk about them damn balloons that they're launching themselves. Oh, the UFOs, the aliens are coming. No, the radiation is in our food. And this young man, Elijah Jordan Brown Garcia, died in Newark's West Ward. I haven't even read the article, but the tragedy occurred last week during a youth team's workout in Newark when Elijah Jordan Brown Garcia was doing two of the things he loved most, being with his little brother and gearing up for football practice. Now, this football he was playing was described as light football because I imagine so many of us are just uh, understandably freaking out about all the youth who are dropping dead, but they're highlighting this sudden death all of a sudden, when they never hide, highlighted a damn thing about all the creatures dying right in the Pacific Ocean and how all this stuff started on the West Coast. Not saying a damn word about that, but all of a sudden, it's all, you know, soon as you see some documentary get a million views, you know it's part of the propaganda. They want us attributing all of this to the jab. That's why they took away my channel, because they were just like, well, wait a minute. No, she proves uh, that she's been talking about this for the longest and explaining it in great scientific detail. So I'm glad we are discussing our discomfort with what seems to be a rise, but you think it could be this more so? You think it could be that the FDA as of, the end of last year, removed all radiation alerts from all Fukushima food grown right around that dis- those destroyed nuclear reactors. Ain't no alerts. They didn't say there's no radiation. They said there's no alerts. So I have to repeat this again and again and again and again. And when the children die... I'm sorry, but it hurts because I know it's not going to get better unless we make it better, unless we employ what they hide this stuff for because there's cures, right? So they're shipping us this food when the Mayanichi Japanese newspaper gave a report that they haven't decontaminated anything. It's just as radioactive. They got freaking radiation. Those green bats down there are filled with the topsoil they dredged up for square miles and miles around those reactors. And they're just as radioactive today as they were over 10 years ago. And they're shipping, look at the 90% of those bags, and there's millions of them are on Fukushima farmland, and they are emitting massive waves of radiation all over the daggone place. And we're eating this stuff? Well, these, oh, don't let me cuss. Um, while these devils know. This is an army freaking photo drawing, sorry. This is an army freaking drawing right here. This is how they have studied precisely, exactingly, ain't no guesswork necessary. That eating or breathing in radiation, you become a freaking radioactive decontamination bag. 
And this stuff doesn't just go away. You can't just hope and pray. Oh, maybe, maybe Sister Ashley is out of a daggone mind. No, we live on a planet controlled by the lunatics who should be in a friggin' nut house. And we're not paying attention to the sister who has consistently been telling you the truth while these devils celebrate the multitude of ways that radiation destroys the very fabric of existence, organic and inorganic. And we're going to question whether I'm just another scammer or something? When, where, how? Please show the proof because it ain't there. It ain't there. Well, this child, he ain't here even now. Okay? I'm just saying. Please hear me. My sincere condolences to this beautiful young boy's family and my ashe. To his spirit, which is the spirit of all our children, and they deserve us protecting them intelligently, wisely, lovingly, staunchly. Whew. Peace and blessings, family. <laughs>